Alright bro, I think we can all agree on the fact that game development is not a traditional career and choosing Roblox as the primary platform just makes things even more unconventional. If you've been in the Roblox platform for a while then you will know that for the past like 4 or 5 years there's been a weird stigma around Roblox mostly because of the gigantic amount of children in this platform. Bro like nah for real bro, most Roblox players are like NPCs. Try talking to one of them and you'll be lucky to even get a response. Like what's wrong with these players man? Back to Roblox weird stigma i gotta admit though it has gotten a bit better over the past year it looks like some older players have started joining the platform it's still the minority but i mean it will always be this way right i remember in 2020 2021 some of my friends from my martial arts club found out that i played roblox you want to know what happened these people looked at me as if i was some sort of pedophile bro and laughed at my face and i'm like yo it's just roblox gang i ain't doing nothing weird in there chill like bro Tell me why one of them was looking at me like this. Honestly, bro, I don't even blame them, bro. I mean, have you seen some of the games in this platform? So if you play Roblox games and you're over the age of 12, apparently you're weird. Why? I don't know. As the dumbest people. Back when I started doing development, I was like, I, right, I'm learning how to code and do some cool stuff for games. This is dope. I wonder what my friend group will think about this. Now, I've never been the type of person to tell anyone what I'm up to. So when I started doing development, only two people in my life knew what I was doing. But one day, one of my closest friends at the time caught me coding. Like, bro, listen, whenever anyone comes to my house, like a friend, or something i turn off my pc unless i'm doing something incredibly important not because i don't want them to know what i'm doing but because i just want to pay attention to whoever is visiting right but this friend bro this is the type of friend that will pull up to your house unannounced bro so ain't nothing i could do about it so one day i'm in my room calling like every other normal day and this day this person just walks into my room bro like I have siblings, why didn't no one tell me that one of my friends had arrived, bro? So once this person enters, we just stare at each other for like two seconds. And I know that she knew damn well that she shouldn't be here. And I'm just like, oh my god, bro, ain't no way this person just pulled up unannounced again. Long story short, she asked what I'm doing with my PC. I just tell her, I'm just coding a game. And when I said that, she was like, oh damn, that's cool. Can I see the results of what you're doing? And at the moment, I was coding like a battle royale game. A very bad one at that. So when she sees this game and she sees that it's in Roblox, she just laughs, bro. And I'm like, Bro, I kid you not, I remember the exact same words that came out of this person's mouth right after she laughed. She said, bro is not Tony Stark. Bro, that did it. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> My self-esteem genuinely dropped a little bit after that day. <laughs> But I mean, I guess it would kind of make sense for anyone to say that since it was a trash game with no cool features. I mean, gotta keep it 100, right? But the fact that everything was fine until she discovered it was Roblox was crazy to me. So with this, what I want to tell you is that if you make video games seriously, you're probably gonna get a lot of weird looks. If you make video games and on top of that, the games that you make are in Roblox, bro, trust me when I say you better off keeping that to yourself unless you got something crazy you can show people. Unless it's a very close friend right trust me just avoid yourself the pain now this is not to say that what we do is shameful i mean we do what we do because we really have a passion for it and maybe some of us even have a talent for it regardless of what anyone said to me back then i'm still here right and that's the important thing the reality is it doesn't matter how you want to put it yeah we are all a bit weird for wanting to create games we're somewhat geeky bro we're no 100 percent normal just think about how many people actually go through the conventional careers like plumbing police officers military engineering law politics etc and compare that to the unconventional careers like game development or youtube and you'll see actually how rare you are embrace that a lot of the most genius and virtuous men that have touched the earth have been weird einstein super weird look him up i mean bro he even looks weird also nikola tesla also super weird and had some missions in the head michelangelo socrates all of these people operated outside of the traditional views of their time and they still managed to push humanity forward in some sense right 
a lot of us besides the passion we also want to probably make a living off of this for the benefits that it could bring right like the financial freedom the time freedom and possibly the location freedom and well i know you're tired of hearing this but sometimes all it takes is one person to repeat something to you for it to truly sink in if you want unconventional results then you must get there through unconventional means Take that as you will and just know man that yes people like you and me were weird probably very weird probably crazy in the eyes of some but at the end of the day someday in the future our time will come and once it does you'll probably be grateful that you did not quit when people started giving you some weird looks so do you feel like you're being judged by other people maybe your friends maybe even your parents i can't guarantee that they'll change their mind but what i can guarantee is that knowing people with the same interest as you really helps with this so join a development community you can check out my discord if you want you don't have to join but if you check it out and you like it then you're more than welcome to join link in the description so yeah don't think you're alone on this you don't have to do it alone there are so many devs here that will gladly help you and share with you they said keep leveling up bro be safe and i'll see you when i see you peace